Let's get you up to speed now on the stories you need to know to start your Thursday morning. Confusion over where to wear masks continues after Governor Ducey rolled back statewide mandates then Phoenix re-implemented the restriction within city limits. The latest incident caught on camera highlighting the back and forth between state and local leaders. This incident at the Trader Joe's on 20th Street and Camelback Road in Phoenix shows a man allegedly coughing on other customers while arguing with employees about his right to not wear a mask. He refers to the governor's rollback in the video. All of this as employees tried to explain to that man private businesses are still allowed to enforce their own policies. The Arizona State Senate voting down an anti-abortion bill. The bill would have charged doctors with the felony if they performed the procedure because of survivable genetic abnormalities like Down syndrome. It would have also allowed the father and maternal grandparents to sue the mother and ban state spending for organizations that provide abortion care. The lawmaker behind the measure can use a procedural move to bring the bill back again. New this morning, a family who just moved to the Valley is asking for your help after someone stole their U-Haul with almost everything they own inside. The Fox family says they were staying at a hotel in Phoenix after traveling from Atlanta. They came out yesterday morning to find their truck and U-Haul trailer gone. The couple says they hope whoever took the trailer will return it because of all the sentimental items inside. A lot of um, like kids ornaments no. that they made when they're little, the kids handprints from the hospital, their footprints, all the memorable stuff. That's 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 the biggest thing that I want back, you know, just heartbreaking. This couple says they have filed the police report. They also set up a GoFundMe to help replace their belongings, at least the re replaceable ones, right? If you'd like to help out, we, we will be posting a link on our website, 12news.com. Breaking news this morning, the number of Americans applying for unemployment benefits rising last week to 744,000. That's up by 16,000 claims from the week before. And it's a sign many employers are still cutting jobs. Jobless claims have declined sharply since last year, but still remain high compared to the to before the pandemic hit. Something we've been keeping a close eye on. And now you're up to speed. Don't forget, you can always find the latest news on our website, 12news.com or the free 12 News app.